season, I'm going to win a Super Bowl. But my entire team will be built exclusively from packs. The rules are very simple. I'm not allowed to use the auction house. Every win I get adds $75 to the bank. And every rage quit is one pack of my choice. Hey, what's good, you guys? Welcome. Let's take a look at our starting team. We've got a 70 overall with silvers virtually everywhere. This team is horrible. But there are a few packs you get just for starting the game. I have an 80 overall Captain Frank Gore. He is absurdly slow at 74 speed, but he's better than the Silvers. The pre-order pack got me Sauce Gardner. This is without a doubt the best player on this team. 85 speed, 85 Excel, 6'3", as our team captain. And everybody gets Jalen Ramsey just for loading up the game. 6'1", 82 speed, 81 Excel. So our DBs aren't that bad. Now, if I want to go undefeated and win a Super Bowl, we're obviously gonna have to fill so many different holes on this team and we're not allowed to buy any single players to kick this team off i'm going with the star elite bundle i'm gonna get 22 gold or better players and 14 elite players so this should be just enough to hopefully secure our first win what do we got tyler davis Jordan Akins and Justin bought a Buike to start out. All right, it's our starting tight end and our starting left end. Have any of you bought gas, groceries, or dined out at any time in the last month? Because if you have, I have an incredible app that can get you cash back on every single purchase. It's my secret sauce for staying on top of everything financial. Now the app is called Upside and they're sponsoring today's video. To get started, you download the free Upside app. There's a link in the top of the description and you can use my promo code Matthew M to get an extra 25 cents back for every gallon on your first tank of gas. Next, you'll claim an offer for whatever you're buying on Upside. Near me is this Speedway and I can get 57 cents back per gallon. I'll claim the offer. Now I show up to the store, pay as usual, follow the steps in the app and I get my cash back. I can cash out at any time to my bank account, PayPal, or even an e-gift card. Like I said, if you buy gas, groceries, or you dine out, and you're not using Upside, you are literally throwing money away. That's how amazing Upside is. So make sure to download the free Upside app with the link in the top of the description and use that code MATTHEWM to get an extra 25 cents back for every gallon on your first tank of gas. Make sure to check it out and enjoy the rest of the video. I can't complain about anything. Calvin Beach, can we take that? Working on the O-line with Will Hernandez and Tim Patrick is wide receiver one. AJ Klein, Derek Barnett, and Ray Andy Gregory, okay. Dude, even 77 overall gold players are like pretty damn good right now. More O-line with Norwell, Raekwon Davis. Oh, boys. All right, who wants to be the first one to try it? Male Asala Amuvea Laulu. I feel like I actually did that pretty good. If somebody send that player to flight and ask flight to do it, I just want to hear what he comes up with. Dre Greenlaw, damn, we got two stud outside linebackers already. I don't mind that at all. We start out here with DJ Reader, 83 D-tackle, big time. All right, defense is loaded up, but I currently have no quarterback. I would really like to pull a quarterback. Darren Paolo, Danny Dimes! No way! Asking you shall receive. Dude, what are the odds? Okay, now I'd like an 86 wide receiver. Oh, okay. I tried, guys. I tried. Ronnie Stanley, though. O-line's looking good. We got Danny Dimes at QB. Our best wide receiver is still Tim Patrick, though. Ben Powers, more O-line. Dylan Cole and Joe Gaziano. Ryder Anderson, Kenneth Walker! I'm definitely putting him over Frank Gore's slow ass. McCole Hardman gold. Yo, that might be a, like a nasty gold, actually. We're on to the topper, though. 84 or better! Oh my god, TJ Watt? Let's go! Dude, my defense is dominant. We have no safeties either now that I just realized it. Next is Jalen Hurts! Oh my god! Dude, Danny, Danny. Danny Dimes is gonna get quick sold. Oh, that's a bummer. Our final player is Aiden Hunt. Dude, I, oh my god. This was so perfect for me. All right, we're currently a 70 overall. Let's see what that one bundle did for us to kickstart pack and play squad up to a 78. I will absolutely take that. Let's talk about the good, the bad, and the ugly of this squad. Backfield, I love, dude. Jalen Hurts, Kenneth Walker. That is awesome. Now, Danny Dimes, as much as I love you, you're honestly dead weight here. He's worth 170 training. That's not a lot, but we can use that training to get other packs, which will potentially actually fill holes. So I do got a quick sell Danny Dimes here. The wide receiver core is pitiful. Tim Patrick is wide receiver one. Hardman is two. And Blake 
control is wide receiver three. On the offensive line, I like this. We've got Ronnie Stanley, Ben Powers, Josh Myers, Hernandez, and Kelvin Beecham. Andrew Norwell is dead weight. I technically could roll these elites into a set as well. Hmm. I'm actually gonna hang on to him. Maybe I shouldn't have quick sold Danny Dimes. I should have looked at sets first. At tight end, we have Gerald Everett and Tyler Davis. Defense is so dominant, but then you look at my safeties and you realize, damn, we're actually kind of a liability in the sky. We've got Dre Greenlaw, TJ Watt. That's insane. Brandy Gregory at middle linebacker. Backup MLB is obviously mid down Henley, but we don't have a choice to do. We got Jordan Howden and Kenny Robinson as my safeties. That's leaving a lot to be desired. Sauce, amazing. Jalen Ramsey, amazing. Jalen Davis, not so amazing. So CB3 still got a big hole in it. So thank God we have Sauce and Jalen Ramsey because I didn't pull a damn corner worth anything. Our D-line is probably the highlight of this defense. Actually, no. Linebackers are the highlight. D-line is the next best. And then the secondary gets a little questionable. Brandon Graham, DJ Reader, Aiden Hutchinson. That's amazing. Danny Dimes quick sold for 170 training. So I can open two of these 74 plus headlines player packs. Doesn't even give me the odds on it, but there is a small chance I can pull something really, really useful here. Even just a wide receiver would be pretty good. We get Alex Wright. I know for a fact he does nothing for us. This might be the last time I do this. I might just hang on to my training for future episodes to try and be smarter with it. Our next 74 plus Larry Roundtree. Yeah, those are bad. Shouldn't have been doing that. Also, y'all, that 3,600 training on this account was already here. I'm not allowed to use that. I need to get rid of it just for visual sake. One more thing to keep in mind is this is pack and play. So any pack I can open, the field pass, since I got to like level two or something, gave me this. A 79 overall unauctionable fantasy and token pack. I'll be honest, I don't even know what this is. But if there's a wide receiver in here, I could take it. Isaiah Likely. I guess he technically could go to wide receiver. Kobe Durant. Ooh, I could take him too for CB3. Vera Tucker's going to be a no. Drake Jackson, no. Wandale Rupt. Reed Blake. I could take a safety too. I almost think I want a safety. Can Dude, this is tough. I'm going to go with Reed Blankenship. I'm going to move him to strong safety. And I don't really know what a front page token does. Use the front page token to upgrade your 79 overall player. Oh, shit. Wait, so I can upgrade Reed Blankenship already? Reed Blankenship has an upgrade already. He is an 80 overall now. That's actually pretty dope. I am definitely going to need this too. All right, boys. This team is ready to go. Offense has got Jalen Hurts, Kenneth Walker, and the rest, I suppose. But defense, we got Sauce Gardner with his AKA shutdown ability, and Reed Blankenship has outmatched. This is kind of crazy, though. This Sauce starts with his X Factor on, which I had no idea was the case. So that's going to be really, really good. Another thing I didn't mention is I never got a kicker. So we have Jake Moody. Jake Moody was an absolute dog in college, but he's he's shit uh, in this game. So Michael Hartman's a kick returner. Gerald Everett's returning punts, I guess. All right, boys, a 78 overall. This is our very first game. Keep in mind, if we win here, we add $75 to the bank. If we force a rage quit, we additionally get any pack we choose. And if we lose, we get absolutely nothing. So let me see. Our top three looks good. His, Bryce Young, Canarius Tony, Rondé Barber. All right, hey, let's get it. A new addition this year is five minute quarters. I knew that was weird. I wasn't certain, but I knew it was weird. Last year was four minute quarters in head to head. So all that means is longer, more intense game for you guys. And I actually really like this. I think in years past, it's been too easy to manipulate the clock. And I was a massive abuser of that. I'm not pretending like I didn't do that. All right, well, let's start this out, boys. Got to make sure TJ Watts going for the QB every time. Sending a big blitz here. Randy Gregory, somebody get him. Let's go, Aiden Hutchinson. Second and 22, I am on Henley is his name. He does not have anything. He's got a check down, but hey, the rookie middle linebacker. I'm going to try a classic mid blitz. I am sick of how much time he has right now. It's a slip screen. Oh shit, it has so much room. I gotta make a play. Okay, good, 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 good. I forced him inside. It's fourth and nine. All right, we're guessing pass. We just gotta play everything here. Come on, boys. Quick turnover for pack and play. Fourth and nine. He wants the dig. The corner, let's, oh, it's a pick six. But whatever, I'm so proud of you. Who was that? It definitely wasn't Sauce Gardner. Hey, all I see is a turnover on the opening drive. Let's go with Kenneth Walker. Off tackle. Spectacular run. Lions first down. First and 10. Let's go stretch left side. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Follow your blockers. Not bad. Now we know huddle. Hit him with the play action. We've been dialing him up with the run right here. Let's see if he bites. Beautiful blocking. 
Keep going, X. I maybe could have done it, but we're just going to step up with Jalen Hurts and take four yards. I don't know. I got a little spooked. I could have thrown something there. Third and three. Let's not get stonewalled. Let's go right at the teeth of this defense. He spreads his D-line. Spread those cheeks wide, baby. Oh, my God. I tell you what, man. The dive this year is different. They jump. They clear that. Look at this fucking dive. So much higher than years past, which is awesome, by the way. That's a very real thing in football. Running backs love to jump over the pile, but we've never had that option in Madden before. Gotta say, though, without a kicker, our kick returns are real short, and I was just fucking about to say that. I was just about to say our kicks are so sh shit. He gets gifted seven points. That's a bummer. I mean, without a good kicker, there's honestly nothing I can do about that. I could kick the ball out of bounds, or I just gotta play the best kick return coverage I can. See, I need somebody like that. I need somebody like Tyler Bass. Just gonna put it way back there. Cole Hardman, why don't you get your own kick return and then it won't matter. Oh my God. Oh my God. Uh, damn, nice return, McCall. I see kick returns are strong as ever. Good Lord. Let's go Kenneth Walker underneath. I blocked Gerald Everett here and just take a peek at this. Kenneth Walker will clear out. Oh my God, he just sat there stuck on his block for so long. That's all right. I can't get frustrated this early, man. We just started. Fine. We've got a turnover already. Let's just play slow and steady. Here we go. Little check down to Kenneth Walker. Damn. Didn't make the best move. Moves us to third and 16. Oh, the dig clears right in the middle. A great ball from Jalen Hurts. That was huge. Huge pickup on third and 16. I think I'm going to stick to the run game, though. The run game got me, punched me in so easy last time. And look at this, man. It's just killing him. Little RPO right here. Let's see how this sets up. Let's just hand that off because I really didn't like anything I saw there. Second and 16. Shit. Glad you're fast, Jalen. Third and 16. Going wide here. Oh, RB. Wait, that might be a bad ball. Whew. Barely connect on that. I got five yards to go. Kind of scared about the silver kicker. I'm not gonna lie. I am a little scared about the silver kicker, but I made that much more manageable for him. Just how bad is this? That was not that bad. That was not that bad at all. I that's all right. On the board. Big field goal. 10 to 7. Oh, you're shitting me, man. How do I forget that so quickly? How do I, like... This happens at the start of every mad, and I get so used to, like, kick returns not being this broken. I literally looked over to ensure that I was recording, and I look back, and I, I, I now have 14 points against me off of kick returns. He has yet to get in the fucking end zone by himself, and he's beating me. Hey, this is how it's gonna go, boys. Wheel of Mutt is gonna be the exact same thing, so I just gotta pony up and get ready. This is free fire. The question is, who is usered on the running back? Frank Gore. Dude, you know what? For 74 speed, that looked a lot faster than 74 speed. That was a deceptive 74. All right, let's bring Tim Patrick across the face of this. I kind of expect his user to jump to it. Oh, barely got that ball off. He's literally just running man blitz after man blitz. All right. I'm going to go McCole Hartman whip route. Let's see how this whip route stands up to man coverage. Fucking torches it. Hell yeah. And a roughing the passer. And we fumbled and he got it. That's the best roughing the passer I've ever seen. You know, corner strike here. Weird play call. Kenneth Walker out of the backfield because he was using that linebacker. Was supposed to be on him. Walker's up. Nasty run. All right, now we're going to play some clock shenanigans here. By that, I mean I'm going to score with no time left and then get the ball at half. See if I can roll out right. That would be very nice. Ooh, I don't have to. Wow, nice ball. I liked how realistic that felt. Like, it was a slightly bad ball rolling out. Kenneth Walker had to jump for it. Lost a little momentum. Guys, I'm not gonna lie. Madden 24 is fucking sick. I like this Madden more than I've liked any Madden since Madden 20. All right, second and two. Excellent run play. Look at this. Kenneth Walker gets absolutely leveled for it. I think he's guessing pass. Gonna go right back at the teeth again. This will take us to the two-minute warning. Ooh. He played that super well with Jordan Poyer. Completely blew that up. Two minute warning here. I'm gonna go at the middle again. I don't care that he, I don't care that he's ready for it. Yeah, that's, yeah. I mean, in, in that set, there's just no way you stop that. I'm gonna go right back to it. Come back out Mike Blitz. All right, beautiful. So long as he stays in Mike Blitz, I am not coming out of this. He calls his first time out. He knows what I'm doing. We go stretch left. He's no longer in nickel. So this actually could stop this. Still doesn't. Big stiff arm from K-Dub. I wonder if he's running a man blitz still, though. If he's running a man blitz, this is just a dead play. Second and three. Let's go. Wow, he really is going to run a man blitz every single play. Should be able to get around it, though. I'm going to go left side. Left side stretch on third and four. Using that clock as best we can. Kenneth. Oh, I just got 
cut it up. Almost had a shot at that. I'm tempted to take this field goal. Actually, no. Here's what he's gonna do. This is actually gonna be really easy for us. We're gonna go shotgun. He's gonna run man blitz. I throw a whip route. This is a man blitz. I'm going to Tim Patrick here. Let's just clear out Hardman so that Hardman's man can't make this tackle. And I'm gonna throw the whip route. And there's the whip route. Come on, man. Hey, you made it too easy for me. I tried to tell you. That was huge. It was good clock management. He has one timeout, 41 seconds. So long as he doesn't return a kick, I think this is pretty easy for us. I have to like genuinely think super hard about my kickoff though. Okay, I'm locked in for the kickoff, guys. I'm here. Let's go kickoff deep right, okay? We're gonna go deep over to the right. I'm gonna aim it full power or as close as I can get. Not super accurate. Let's see how this does. So what side do I gotta go with to Turk, you know? What am I supposed to do? He's getting the best blocks in the world. Holy shit. Got out to the 38. I need a kicker, man. All right, we're gonna guess pass here. I just have to match. Oh, slip screen, slip screen. We see it. Bryce Young is blowing up. I'm calling a timeout. I want this ball back. I want to score again. Second and 21. We're guessing pass again. I'm over here. I'm over here. No. Hey, great breakup from Sauce Gardner. Third and 21. Absolutely massive play right there. Oh, no. I'm blitzing too many people. I can't blitz Henley. Get there. Oh, he doesn't. It. It's fourth and 21. He's got a punt. Look at this, bro. This guy can't do a damn thing. And he's got 14 points. Hey, that's all right, boys. Let's go score. We got two timeouts still. We retained two. I don't have a feeling my punt return's very good. I literally have Gerald Everett returning punts. But that was a deep punt. I'm going to outkick this coverage. Oh, damn. Gerald Everett. I'm impressed. Although, when I think of clock management, I think Loki, I should have just fair caught that. Let's see if he's still in man. If he's still in man, he should know what I'm doing. I'm going to Hardman. He does. Look at that. Oh, he's not. That's zone. Oh, but Hardman. Get down. Timeout. Six seconds on the clock. My only concern is my kicker's so shit that I got to probably get a little closer than normal here. We think this is man still or zone? Zone. Let's go. Everett. Get down! Get down! Get down! Longest fucking... <sighs> I can't be mad about that. I probably should have dove or, like, slid or something after catching it. Damn, I just thought I had more time than that. Uh, definitely could have had an extra three points there. We'll see if it matters. Hey, we start with ball here, though, which I love. Thank God we recovered it, but bro, this is just stupid. The fact that kick return is this impactful on a game is crazy. Wait, he did get the ball? I thought I recovered it. He has two touchdowns and an additional possession from that. Oh, that's that's really stupid. He's going to pass. He's going to go back to the slip screen. He really likes this play. And we drop the pick, unfortunately. It is a D tackle, but another slip screen? No. This one's a check down to the halfback. Kind of saw that coming, but can't get there fast enough. Randy Gregory is a bit slow. Okay, we know it's a run. Is it an edge run or up the middle? It's up the middle. Blanket ship! Run! Oh my goodness! I don't expect him to run again. I really don't, but I'll be ready for it if he does. I'm, I'm thinking this is play action. Wow. He runs it again. Blanket ship's there again. Neither of my hit stick fumbles are a fumble, but the one on fucking kick return is. Could be a run still. It's not. Get there! You're... Oh, my God. You are right next to that. This is a frustrating game. Gotta go score. Have to get a touchdown here. It is non-negotiable. I'm gonna go play action on this. Looking at Gerald Everett. Ooh, don't need Gerald Everett when you got that. Look at McCole Hardman. McCole Hardman making up for that fumble early. Nice work. Lots of man blitzes. More man blitzes here. Spectacular blocking and great running by Frank Gore. I'm gonna go back to this play action. I think he's still in man, so... Damn, Matt Milano looked that right off. Zone, 100% zone. Where the hell is that ball going? Poor accuracy deflected. Jalen just threw a mallard. I got bailed out that he didn't pick it off, but I don't know how that ball was thrown so piss poor. Okay, if this is man, I hit Hardman. If it's zone, I hit Davis. I don't know who Davis is. Zone. I'll go right at his user. I know he's dog shit. Oh, and it gets knocked out. And now it's fourth and 17. Honestly, punting is my best call because he can't do anything on actual offense. We just got to hope that we can actually cover the punt. I almost just want to punt this out of bounds. Did I punt it out of bounds? Gotta work on my punting, boys. I'm not a punt daughter. This is a tough game. Is it a slip screen again? He really likes the slip screen. Oh no, he actually runs it. What? Whew. Keep it together, Matt. Keep it together, Matt. Matt, you can't win if you're mad. If I get really upset, and all that, like I will, I will just straight up lose, right? I need an INT. I need him to make a mistake. He's chewing clock now, 21 to 17. I'm surprised he got that off, but he did. Sugar week. I don't know what this is, but I'm gonna try it. Pinch blitz out of sugar week. I'm gonna user sauce gardener in the middle. It's a weird play. I like that defense action. It's kind of nice. Felt like it had a lot covered. I need a pick six, man. Slip screen, throw it, throw it, throw it. 
Oh my god, he just rolled out left on a slip screen and completed? Stay together, Matt. Keep it together. You're, you're tweaking. I am tweaking. I'm not going to lie to y'all. <laughs> That's crazy, man. That was... I can't tell. I think this is Mike Blitz. If it's not Mike Blitz, I'll go back to Everett. Oh, perfect. Damn, he actually he played that really well. That's okay because I don't think they play on Davis that well. And if they do, I go A. Jesus. Hell of a play on third and 10 to Kenneth Walker. He's still in Mike Blitz. Beautiful. Beautiful fucking throw. I, I thought McCall Hardman just fumbled again. Second and one. Let's get to the edge. Beautiful. Fucking immaculate run. Wow. <laughs> That's fucking sick. I've never seen that. <laughs> That was dope. 23-28. Coach wants me to go for it. I don't hate that call. I'm going to throw this. No, I'm going to run this right at the middle. He's in. Oh, my God. Curls up in a ball. Flies over the top. I'm going to try a sky kick. I don't really know what sky kicks do this year. My hope is that if it doesn't go to Hardman, it'll be at least better. I just can't imagine DeAndre Swift. It's a much better option. How are we taking just that bad of angles? That didn't, make, that didn't make sense. Could be slip screen again. He is fucking horny about slip screen. He is sure is. Bruh. That really should have been an INT in my eyes, but all right. It's all good. I'm going to guess pass. I'm going to get on the halfback. He's going halfback. Ooh! TJ Watt! TJ Watt gets home! It's third and 21. We know it's a pass. Blocking his halfback. He wants to throw right over here. Uh, okay. Oh, blanket ship, I needed you a little more. It's fourth and three. He's got to go for this. From the 39, he's got to go for this. He 100% will. He's really hoping we would get to the QB a little bit faster, but that's okay. I got to get on the halfback. He wants to throw halfback. I know it. Get there! Headley! Let's go! Oh, after everything. After everything that's happened here. A big opportunity to win. And you know what I was saying about five-minute quarters? This is why five-minute quarters is awesome. Because if somebody returns two fucking kicks on me, and then I fumble on a kick return, that's game over if it's four-minute quarters. Listen, I'm not going to say we're going to win, but I'm saying we've got a shot. And Kenneth Walker on the edge. Stay in bounds. I want that clock gone when he has the ball. Two seconds on the clock. We'll snap. Excellent blocks. Way to get inside Kenneth Walker. It's Kenneth Walker's having a monster game. 12 rushes, 117 yards, and two touchdowns. It's the run that is keeping us in this game. Gotta get the win, though. Two-minute warning's coming up here. He knows it. I know it. We all know it. 25 to 28. Two minutes left. The season opener of pack and play. I could really, really use the 75. Let's go with a quick inside zone, making a big play. I don't want the first. Damn it. I did not want that first down. He doesn't see the stretch, I don't think. He did. He saw it. Let's just see how this sets up. Second and 10. Tim Patrick wide open in the middle. He got the first no touchdown. Let's go. Oh, that is 1,000% best case scenario. I have no idea how fullback dives or QB sneaks operate this year. Like, I don't know how good they are. He wants me in the end zone. He wants me to score. Of course he does. He's not even using his timeout. I'm going to not get this if it's possible. I'm going to try and stop this right on the half yard line. It's not going to be easy though. I might have so much momentum. Hey, good try, buddy. Say my first rodeo. <laughs> Let's go. He's going to call a timeout now. So we've got him to burn a timeout. Now he wants to stop it. I have no idea how good QB Sneak is this year. But hey, I got Jalen Hurts. If there's ever a guy for QB Sneak, it's Jalen Hurts. Touchdown. Okay, that's, I mean, it's a little bit premature. But to burn his extra time out from just sitting there with the fullback, that's massive. The biggest issue here is the kickoff. Where, where the fuck do I kick this ball so that he doesn't start on the 50? There's nowhere that I can kick this so that he doesn't start on the 50. He's going to start on the damn 50 no matter what I do. I'm going to try and get this right in the corner with full power, full accuracy, right in the corner. This is as much as I can do for us, boys. That's as much as I can do. Let's go, Joseph. Try and blow this up. Good! Hey, that's the best we've done. He's on the 35. That's the best we've done. Sacking the QB is the best thing we can do here. No. Oh, he's got a bomb. Oh, no. Did Jalen Ramsey just get cooked? Let him score. Let him score. Jesus! What is happening? I can't do anything. Look how close we are to him. Still throws a laser. One play touchdown. Three timeouts. Gotta go score again. Shit. Okay. Is he manned up on Gerald Everett here? Could be a zone still. I have nothing. Oh, good job, Jalen. Jalen made something out of nothing there and gets out of bounds. A verticals concept here. Get there, Everett. Fucking money. Oh. No, what? What? How did he? 
What? Dude, I thought Gerald Everett was gonna house that bitch. That was like a cartoon tackle. He got his ankle slapped. I don't know what he's in here. It's like a very, dude, Gerald Everett has been absolutely essential to what we're doing here. I'm gonna ship my line right so I can roll out. Just kind of make a play here. Can I go A? Maybe I could have, but oh, that's a bad ball. Third in inches, let's just pick it up. Yeah, ooh, ooh, Frank Gore. First and 10. This could be a Tim Patrick touchdown if this is the zone I think it is. Kind of just depends what his user does. I'm gonna send him a Hardman decoy. So hopefully Tim Patrick's there, right over the middle. <sighs> that was a sketchy ball. I'm playing with fucking fire right now. I can always kick the field goal and go to OT. I don't have to be greedy here. I kind of want to be greedy. I think this has been just an absurd game. Yeah, because he's not pressed up unless he's in Tampa too. I think Gerald Everett could be a touchdown. I think Gerald Everett is a touchdown. Oh, did I just get a penalty? I just got a delay game. That's okay. It, it does Actually, that might be better. To wide out of Tampa too, you actually kind of want this space. I am definitely not upset with that. Let's just take the easy yards. Big boy, big boy. Third and eight, that's our last time out. So we gotta go for it all here. I don't know what to look at here. Third and eight. Oh, I had him, shit. I gotta get rid of this ball and try again. I fucking had Hardman, didn't I? Fourth and eight, do I take this into OT? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go into overtime. I sold that, I should have just thrown it to Hardman, I had him. Huge kick from Jake Moody. Drills it. Dude, like, oh, please don't kick return this, man. Please just don't kick return this. He has too many points from kick returns. I'm gonna squib. I assume a squib is a safe kick in this game, right? There's just no way you return a squib, right? I shouldn't say that. That's gonna go all the way back to Kadarius Tony. Are you fucking kidding me, you guys? This is the worst case scenario. <laughs> to return a squib. Three kick return touchdowns. That's crazy. Dude, I did everything humanly possible. Ken the Walker had an amazing game. 13 for 117. Frank Gore, 6 for 42. Dude, this guy was just watching Madden. He's just watching kick returns. I literally would have been better off onside kicking every single kick. I don't get why my coverage team is so bad. Like, I get my kickers bad, but why is my coverage team so bad? I gotta see this. So are they just, are the blocks just being held perfectly on everybody? What are you doing here? Who's 52? AJ Klein. What is this? Why did you do that? Just go tackle him. Well, it was a great game, boys. Damn, 35 to 41, a loss in our opener for pack and play. Sorry, boys. I wish I could have won that game, but it was not the cards. Next episode, I have no money in the bank. So next episode, I got to get a win to put some more in and hopefully find a way to get a kicker on this lineup. I love you, boys. I'm going to get you a dub next time. Peace.